And we have the, you know, the privilege of calling him our power, man. All right. This is a rock two and one. It says, my son, if thou come to serve the Lord, prepare thy heart for temptation. Set thy heart aright, which is thy mind, and constantly endure and make no haste in time of trouble. Yeah, we can't, you know, a lot of men, you know, they'll leave the truth because they, 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 they tired of their process of being refined. <laughs> you know, they, they, they're tired of it, man. They tired of, you know, uh, the fallouts with the family and, you know, being a black sheep at work. And, you know, they're tired of those things, man, having certain restrictions and you can't just, you know, indulge in Babylon. Okay, which all that is part of the of the refining process, man. And, and Jake, you know, hey, Jake tapped out, you know. And that's why we got to stay engaged because the thing that's keeping us in here, man, is Yahweh Shah. That's why we got to be engaged with Yahweh Shah, man. You know, more and more. Okay. And it says, verse 3, cleave unto him. Yep. And it said, cleave unto him. When we, when we go through the affliction, it don't be time to, you know, start going backwards you know you go through affliction you know and, and, and the, the, the flesh wants to stop reading the flesh wants to stop praying the flesh wants to stop being around brothers man you know and make the affliction okay the focal point nah man the affliction gonna be there we gotta keep your house shot the focal point okay keep him at the center of this thing man okay because you go into uh uh um those three Hebrew boys, all right, Hananiah, all right, Mishael, and Azariah, okay, who was in the fire with them? Yeah, I was right, Yahweh Shah. Good, 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 good. So God. we have to stay tapped in God, and God, make God. the God. affliction, okay, the focal point. Nah, man, God. the affliction going to be there. We got to keep Yahweh Shah the focal point, okay? Keep him at the center of this thing, man. Okay, because you go into uh, uh, um, those three Hebrew boys, all right, Hananiah, all right, Mishael, and Azariah, okay, who was in the fire with them? Good. All right, Yahweh Shah. Good, good. Okay? Good, good. So we have to stay tapped in, okay, and Yahweh Shah, you know, you got to stay tapped in with Yahweh Shah, okay, and we can endure the fire, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God, God, God. God, hey, God. Woo! Who was in the fire with Shadrach, Misha, and Abednego? Yahweh Shah, and Mashiach. Kahalal, Wahawad, La Abunawa, Wabunwa, Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shah, Bahasham, Wahaha Kodash. And double honor to my teachers, the apostles, the elders, and the bishops of Great Millstone, who watch over our souls. Shall I warm to the Yakim who avoided our sincere and serious doing the will of Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai Bahasham Rakha Kodash. Second Peter chapter 1, verse 1 or 2 to you all. Stay strong, stay mighty. So yeah, yeah, I'm the brother, the disciple Kusha Banyame from the branch in Great Millstone Barbados. And um I want to respond to that brother's video from Mississippi. You know what I mean? And the brother is here in Trinidad. All right? It's time to show us and foremost, we like to give all praises, all honor, and all glory to Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Hashem, Rakan Kodash. Now, we're going to start first with the Zagreb Mason, our teachers who surely do well. And salutations to the men and brethren in this book in truth and in sincerity, because the four cons they find good, risking their lives to do so. Shabbat Shalom. All right. Um, this lesson um, basically is, is entitled, um, It's time to show your trust in the Lord. Right? Because when we. Um, <laughs> We in, we in those trying times where the foundation or the foundation of the earth is being um, overturned. You know, that piece of paper out there, they overturn, overturn, overturn it. The Lord is overturning 
this kingdom and this kingdom is a wicked kingdom is a wicked a wicked uh, empire a wicked rulership and um, we, we have been trained and taught to have certain securities in this kingdom mm. and what is happening is that throw the body upon observation well i see them boy yes yo <clears throat> Right? These securities are being um, made weak. Right? The Lord is making them weak within. With, with, within. Yeah. yeah, within the brotherhood. You know, we be suffering, which we know we're going to have to suffer losses. But we are learning to. Uh, what you have to do is recognize that what is being done is that the Lord is taking away your confidence in the different strengths of the world. For example, if you don't look at Kaita bread on this side. Unless you have the skills to make bread from scratch, right? Which we live in any information age. If you, if you, you can make bread from different different uh, manner of uh, 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 stuff, different different um, fruits and vegetables, and, you know, you can make bread, you know. And there's not one way to make bread. It's not only a uh, wheat bread, right? But, you know, you can be, you can, you can be edified on how to, sust how to be sustained. But the, the, the fact of the matter is that it's about putting your trust in how much you know, Right, because he's taking away the securities, right? And he's making it even more difficult to believe in his strength. And you know, it, it becomes frustrating at times and it can be great doubt, it can be great fear, right? But this is this is this is you trusting in the Lord, this process is us trusting in the Lord that when Jacob trouble fully hits, right, you're not gonna be moved. You know, the scripture says wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of his time and the strength of his salvation, right? Like year 10 and 20, it shall come to pass in that day that the remnant of Israel and such as I escape of the house of Jacob shall no more again stay upon him that smote them, but shall stay upon the Lord Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai, the Holy One of Israel. Yeah, the truth. Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai is going to be. Yeah, so I just want to get two precepts there, man. You know what I mean? That, um. <clears throat> Can cross my mind. Cause hey, um like you heard the brothers here, you know to take away, um like he did with Job, you know. Remember there's a test. Sitting all now sitting in heaven talking to Yahweh. Man, he you only trust in you because he got you got a hedge of protection over you. But take away this and take away that, see if it don't curse to his face. You see? Oh no, big! Just put your name there. Read the book of Job, the the first or the second chapter. I put your name there. Has thou considered my servant? Boom! Put your name there. Is that? Right? Cause my name there. I know. I know my dear coming be, and he made a vote to Yahweh, but Hashem was shy when they first came in this truth. They made a mistake, and I told them, hey, I ain't doing that again. You know what I mean? I do that again. I uh, you know you're all doing. He made the stakes even higher. You want to bet? You know you yeah. <laughs> you, you betting me? You know you got the stakes higher. Is that right? so? Normally, Eli Asher want to say no. You gotta take a leak of faith. You gotta walk on water. Is that? Right? Because them times coming, big man. Them times coming, big. Is that? Right? See the see there's a new COVID variant now. If you're paying attention, Psalms 23. I think I'm going to straight to the point in verse 4. Yeah, do I walk through the valley of the shadow of death? Because everywhere you turn, big man, death is right there. Some sort of trouble, some some misfortune. That's what this world brings, big man. Yeah, do I walk through the valley of the shadow of death? I will fear no evil, meaning bad times. Eve means age and ill means bad, bad age or bad time. I will fear no evil, for thou art with me, thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. This truth. See? Right? This truth. So like three Hebrew boys, there was in that literal fire, and Yahweh Shai was there with them. You see? Right? The Lord told his disciples, and Lord, I am with you always, even unto the end of the world. So are we are we not in the end of the world right now? So Yahweh Shai is, is with us, be in spirit. Is that? Right? He's with us in spirit, big man. Is that? Right? 
You will never leave thee nor forsake thee, man. Psalm 23, verse 4, NLT. Even when I walk through the darkest valley, I will not be afraid. For you are close beside me. Your rod and your staff protect and comfort me. See? So you have a choice there with us. You know what I mean? You just got to believe. You just got to believe and be money. And, and he will manifest himself unto you, man. You see? Whatever situation you find yourself in, he will manifest himself, manifest himself to you. You see? And when he treat you, good boys, there was, there was defiant even unto death. Because he told the king, you will not serve the gods, nor worship the golden image which thou hast set up. So the man was defiant. The man was, the man was defiant. You see? The man, the man in, the, hey, hey, let me get a preset there. It's Acts 5 and 29. See? Acts 5. Because they make a boil down too. You know what I mean? They're going to boil down too. That karag, my boy. Real thing. Come in, big man. Real close. Real fucking close, boy. Acts 5. And they like a boil down to verse 29. Acts 5, verse 29. <coughs> so like you. Acts 5 verse 29. Then Peter and the other apostles answered and said, and said We ought to obey the most high rather than men. See? And what the Lord said in Revelation 14. Revelation 14 verse 9. And the third angel. Follow them, saying with a low voice, If any man worship the beast and his image and receive his karagma in his forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of the Mosai, which is poured up without mixture into the cup of his indignation, and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. So you disobey the Lord, you take that karagma, you really accept it, Esau, as your Lord and governor, and protector and provider. That's what you've done. Is that? That's what you've done. So the trial of our faith, the trial of my faith, but like I tell you, boy, I know the day coming, big man. <clears throat> I know the day coming. And and your family members, hey boy, work colleagues. Let me tell you, it's gonna be real pressure, right? But if you deny the Lord before me, I won't get that here too. Job twenty three verse ten. But He knoweth the way that I take. When He have tried me, I shall come forth as gold. See, He knows the way that I take. But when He have tried me. You get that in the, uh, I want the word tried. You get this here in shot shot, man. Strong's H974. Bachan. Bachan. All right. Generally and figuratively to investigate, examine, prove, tempt, Try trial to test proof try of gold persons the heart man of God to be try proved so to test proof try of gold persons the heart of man of God so we supposed to be gold but we can get try boy can you have fire the project where infirmities are in there that the Lord don't want to make you pure. I read that in the book of Job, that's not right. When he have tried me, I should come forward as gold. See? Real thing, so.
the day coming, examine, scrutinize with the metaphor of gold. And I will try them as one tries gold. Sorry. All right, so to be tried, proved. See? So he does the true baptism, boy. You know, you, you, you get dip in our water. <clears throat> you get dip in that fire, Salakia, right? Which is the different trial and temptations you're getting through. You see? That's how you get baptized now, boy. And like I said, that day coming. That day coming. We ain't gonna make a decision, boy. Right? Get yeah, with this preset here. I'm going to this preset here, man. Deuteronomy 30, verse 90. I call heaven and earth to record this day against you that I have set before you life and death, blessing and cursing. Therefore, choose life that both thou and thy seed may live. See? So, yeah, boy. You try to your faith. And you really get put to the test, boy. But you know, the Lord said, He should never leave thee nor forsake thee. You know what I mean? Real thing. So, yeah, I just want to do this short video, man. Respond to the two brothers there. You know what I mean? The test with Revelation 3 and 10. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to try, or I meaning test them. That dwell upon the world. Real thing. I mean, luxuries get taken away. You can't go out and buy your favorite taco spot. Or your favorite spot where you drink a good drink. You know what I mean? You may go go back catching bus. Real thing. But we got to be like the woman that held you. How she is gamma. At the end of your house, gamma. I know this man. Could heal me, you know what I mean? Yeah, let me get one last preset there, but no comment. My dear, that's John 6. Will you also go away? I better let that. Uh, will you also go away? John 6. Come when the fire get hot, even hotter. <coughs> Some men, when you go to the, the book of John 6 and, um, uh, St. John 6, uh, 59. These things said he in the synagogue. Yahweh Shabbat was talking about he is the bread from heaven, etc., right? These, remember in Matthew 13 and 9, it was given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, but to them it is not given. All right, just remember that. These things said he in the synagogue as he taught in Capernaum. Many therefore of the, his disciples, when they had heard this, said, This is a hard saying, who can hear it? When the Havashai knew in their knew in himself that his disciples murmured at it, he said unto them, Doth this offend you? What? And if you shall see the Son of Man ascending up where he was before, it is the spirit that quickeneth the flesh profiteth nothing. The words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. But there are some of you that believe not. For Yahweh Shai knew from the beginning who there were that believe not and who should betray him. And he said, Therefore said I unto you that no man can come unto me except it were given unto him of my father. From that time many of his disciples went back I walk no more with him. They took the hand of the pro. Sorry. Then said, Yeah, I will show you unto the twelve, will you also go away? Then Simon Peter answered him, Lord, to whom shall we go? Thou hast the words of eternal life plain. Sorry. <coughs> 
So the point is in verse 66, the, the, the disciples went back and walked no more with him. They were called, but he wasn't chosen. You see? They couldn't handle Yahweh Shai saying. See? They want to remain in their own mindset when the scripture says, um, what's it like here? All right, but that's it. Yeah, that's it. That's it. So, yeah. Yeah, just wanted to do this short video, man. You know what I mean? But you also go over here. Is that right? For that time, many of his disciples went back and walked no more with him. Yeah, they get offended, man. They get offended wherever <coughs> situation you're going through. We can't get offended, boy. Can't get offended. See, John 6, 66, and the NLT. And at this point, many of his disciples turned away and deserted him. See? So, yeah, the time coming, boy. You know what I mean? Where will your faith, faith, where will my faith be? You see? Yeah, I praise. It brings me to the end. When you see the Yahweh Shai clock, then crack them clothes, you know what I mean? Because we can need faith in these times to come. I got to quote Elias Shawamba again. We got to step out on water, boy. <laughs> you hear the thing? With no end in sight, we got to step out on water. God, I love Yahweh Shai. Shai. Shai.